Hey guys, Stacy here. Hope all has been well. It's been a little while since I've done a Let's Play. I had the meetup and then we had Thanksgiving here in the US, so I was quite a bit busy that week. <laughs> but I'm here. Again, I promise there will always be more Let's Plays. Um, but it's Christmas time. Who's so excited for Christmas? Me. <laughs> I started playing Star Stable last year at Christmas time. December 6th is officially my one year Star Stable anniversary. That's when I made my character and signed on for the first time. So <laughs> I'm very excited. It's awesome to be celebrating one full year in Star Stable. It's been an amazing adventure and it it's mostly because of you guys. <laughs> you guys are so awesome. The community is awesome. And I'm so excited to be standing here. I remember standing here last December and not quite sure. I think I called this a dude, <laughs> but it's definitely a lady and she's got some Christmas stuff. I thought I had bought a bunch of Christmas stuff. I know I got quite a few things from Santa. Obviously I bought the gear that North Shadow is wearing. Um, the saddle, I think, was a gift from Santa. But I looked in my wardrobe, and I only have, like, one Christmas sweater. So, um, I'm going to take a peek here with this lady. Oh, yeah, look, there's a bunch of stuff I didn't get. I didn't, I didn't spend as many star coins last year. So, I'm anxious. Oh, good, we can finally get the blanket, because I'm high enough level. You have to be level 10. So I'm going to buy up this stuff and then we'll be all set for Christmas. <laughs> it's times like this when I wish we had bigger bags. <laughs> I'm loving the red and green striped pants. Those are awesome. The dress is adorable. I kind of want to wear a sweater. Ooh, I do like that jacket. Yeah, like this, that goes really well. I need some pants though, <laughs> for sure. It's chilly now. <laughs> Um, red works. I think I have a red Santa hat. Look, it lashes a little bit with my hair now, but oh well. And I think there were green glasses. That's cool. We'll do that for now. Oh, oh, shoes. Oh my gosh. How can I forget shoes? I need red shoes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we look really dorky with the green glasses. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. Um, but I was also excited there's a helmet with stars on it, which matches the saddle I got from Santa last year. A lot of people have asked me about this saddle. I got it from doing the Santa quest last year. So that's cool. Oh, let's put that on there. On Oh god, it makes her look so little. What is that? It looks like a palm tree on the saddle pad. What is that, you guys? Is it supposed to be like mistletoe or holly? Looks like a palm tree. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> Yes, we are so ready for Christmas. North Shadow is my official Christmas horse. I think the... And maybe Moon Diamond will be as well, because it just looks so good. On the gray fur. Oh, I've gotten so many letters from you guys. I have a group here that I still need to open. <laughs> and I have some um, in the other room. Um, but I'm going to read some today during the video. I'm so excited. I love getting letters from you guys. They're always so happy and always so friendly. I love it. Hey, Steve. We're ready for Christmas. Yay! Guess what, Cadence? It is Christmas soon again, and there is always so much to do to be ready. There are Christmas trees, food, decorations, everything you can think of. It all takes time to get ready for Christmas Day. I'm sure you remember from last year. Remind the councilman in Silverglade that it is probably time to start to get ready. I've already begun to plan, and I know that Will has already decorated his windmill. He is always a bit early with that kind of thing. Oh, we don't want to do a telescope today. We want to do Christmas today. Yay! Yay, Christmas! <laughs> you know what? I bet a fjord would make an awesome Christmas horse. Ooh! Or the white and illusion. Oh, man. Hello, Cadence. Of course I know it is time to get ready for Christmas. Steve doesn't have to worry. I'm thinking of starting the preparations tomorrow. Same procedure every year. As you can see, I'm already wearing my Christmas hat. Oh, no. Can't wait till tomorrow? Alright, you seem so eager. We better start right away, then. Ho oh, ho, Cadence, it is finally time to start again. Christmas is coming soon, and there is a lot to get done before we are ready. Do you really have time to help the village get ready for Christmas? Of course we do. 
I could promise you some Yorvik shillings and a nice Christmas present if you help us here in Silverglade with the Christmas preparations. Sometimes you'll be rewarded with special Christmas wishes, which you could trade for gifts from Santa. He's usually found in the middle of Yarlaheim Town Square this time of year. Will you help us get Christmas to Silverglade? Yes, especially if we get a Christmas wish. That's great. You won't regret it. This year's Christmas present is really nice. I'll have little jobs for you every day until Christmas from now until Christmas when you get your gift. There's a lot to do, but you will still have time to take care of your horse, keep training, and still have some time for your friends. I promise. You'll probably get something nice in the present you'll get from Santa by trading in your Christmas wishes. Let's roll. <laughs> he likes saying the word Christmas over and over and over again. What is a Christmas without a Christmas tree? Ask our dear Conrad Marston down in Moreland if he can help us get a nice tree. Oh, bay! Ride down to his forge in Moreland and ask if he has a nice tree. We'll see you soon. Yes, sir. So what have you guys been doing to prepare for Christmas? Tree is up at my house. That's typical. Hello, Cadence. Christmas again? Already? Time flies when you're having fun. Or when you are working as much as I do. Hey, it's flown for me. I've had a blast. This past year has, like, gone by in a snap. Hey, look, there's my old hair. Hey, purple hair. I miss you. Jamie Northsmith. <laughs> I get excited over weird things like hair. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't have time to cut down a tree right now, but... You have proven yourself to be strong and resourceful, so I have no problem with lending you my axe so you can do it yourself and pick the best tree. It's a good thing they don't know me in real life. I don't think anybody would actually trust me with an axe. <laughs> there are nice trees up in Nilmers Island. Ride up into the area where the bobcat compete behind the old abandoned farm. You will definitely find some good Christmas trees there. Be careful with the axe. It is very sharp. Come back to me when you're done. Yes, sir. I love this sweater. <laughs> I wish I had this sweater in real life. Oh my gosh, I totally remember this quest from last year. <laughs> With the tree, I remember laughing so hard. It was one of the first quests I did. It must have been in my first, like, five videos. <laughs> oh, nostalgia. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's still funny. Oh, especially because I was completely inside of it for a second. <laughs> Just as funny. Oh my gosh. I actually did this quest on Nova um, yesterday. I recorded the next two episodes. <laughs> and doing this on the Shire was so difficult. The tree, the Shire is big enough. It's hard enough to see around the Shire. And then with the tree on the back, oh my god. <laughs> it was a mess. <laughs> Needless to say, it was a mess. <laughs> we have your tree. Well, I guess it's not his tree. We have a tree, the tree, Silver Glades tree. Look at that tree. That is a great tree. That is you inside that tree, Cadence, right? Not too big? That's right. A Christmas tree can never be too big. It will look great in the square in Silver Glade Village. Just as nice as last year's tree. Lucky that you have a strong horse that can manage it. Not all horses can. Take the tree to the councilman in Silverglade Village. He is going to be really proud of the great tree you found. Give him my regards. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Cursed in Haystone. She can't see my tree, but she's probably like, Why is this girl walking right through me? What gives? Hmm. <laughs> Where are you, councilman? Here comes a tree riding a horse. Aha, uh -huh, you are there too. <laughs> what a fantastic tree. I'm almost weeping with happiness. This is going to be a great to have in the square of our little village. Is there another one? Okay. <laughs> While you were away, I have prepared the place for... Th Whoa, where did that person come from? <laughs> this year, the tree is going to be on the west side of the square, right here behind the city hall. Just like every other year. You know. Take the tree now and put it up in its place, please, Cadence. Yes, sir. Oops, excuse me, excuse me, Ellie. <laughs> hey, look at that snowman. He looks pretty bare. <laughs> looks a little creepy. Creepy snowman. <gasps> yes! Beautiful. Beautiful. 
Ellie Macpie. Dark Cowgirls Gang. Oh man, you don't want to run into those Dark Cowgirls Gang. They'll mess you up. Not bad, I could tell from here that the tree is perfect. Come back tomorrow and I will have another little thing for you to help out with. Sure! Now we can take our Christmas wishes to Santa and exchange them for presents. Oh man, everybody looks scary in Silver Glade. Freya Darkheart of the Dark Scorpions Army. All dressed in black. Santa, we're here! There he is! Hey, big guy. How's it going? Santa! Ho, 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 I'm Santa. Who's been naughty? Who's been nice? And what's the name of this lovely little girl with whom I have the honor of speaking? It's Cadence, Santa! <laughs> That's a fine name indeed. I wish you a very Merry Christmas. Thank you, Santa! Have you seen that there's something missing here? Right, the Christmas tree. I always spend time in the town square here in Jarlheim every year, but it seems this city always forgets to prepare for the holidays. Oh well, maybe you could help me? Ride over to Gavin, Jarlheim's guard. Tell him I've arrived and that I, as usual, am wondering where the Christmas tree is. It may come as a surprise to him, but Christmas actually comes every year at the same time. Ho ho ho. Oh, cheeky Santa. Oh, we know about Christmas wishes. I think we have a couple. Yes. Two. Let's trade them in. A hat. Oh. A green hat! Nice! I don't have green- I don't have any green hats, I don't think. What's this? <gasps> Ooh! Red winter trench coat! I like that a lot, you guys! That's very nice! I think I have pants that match that back in my wardrobe. Oh, some people have asked me to do a home stable tour and like a wardrobe thing and discuss some of the pieces because I get asked a lot where uh, my wardrobe comes from. So I've been thinking about doing that in addition to still wanting to do the the house tag. Oh gosh, I think that would be so much fun. I got some thumbs up for that. So I'm excited to do some of those. I'm liking it. Thank you, Santa. Much appreciated, kind sir. Let's go talk to Gavin about a tree. It does not surprise me <laughs> at all that he forgot that it was Christmas. Mm -hmm. Um, Christmas? Christmas? Christmas, you say? Oh, oh, right, it's true. Christmas comes every year around this time. And it's up to me to arrange the Christmas tree. You say I've not done that yet? No, I would rather seem I haven't. There aren't many fir trees growing in the Harvest Counties, but thankfully there's a small grove of trees flourishing just beyond the houses north of Yarlaheim. Here, take this chainsaw and fix this up with a Christmas tree. Would you help me with that? If there's a chainsaw involved, sir, I will be happy to help. If this were real life, I don't think I would do this. It's way too close to the edge of this cliff. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh, Nora's shadow. She's gonna get lots of treats for carrying these heavy trees. Ooh, that was close. I think we returned to Gavin. Okay, yeah. What a spectacular pine tree. I could never put that tree up by myself, but maybe you and your horse could do it for me? The tree needs to stand at its usual place by the fountain on the great square, right next to where Santa has landed. For two Christmas wishes. Yeah. We got this. Ooh. So beautiful. Back to Gavin, I think. I think.
The tree is up. We're ready. Or, oh right, it needs decorations as well. That's true. Oh, white baubles. Got it. Red baubles. Got it. And tinsel. I know what clockwise is, Gavin. Clockwise. We got it. We're good. Now we're running clockwise. Oh, we did it. Okay, good. Yay. Oh, marvelous. Marvelous. Really good. Ready? Good. Needs more tinsel? Yes, it does look a little bare. I agree. The tree does need more tinsel. I could see that even from here. Take this pile of tinsel and do the same as you did with the other pile, but this time, ride counterclockwise. Counterclockwise is the opposite direction of how the clock moves. We got it. We got it. Tinsel time. Why don't these coins stack? I know that they do. But they don't auto stack. See, look. Whoa bam! Whoa bam! Brilliant, sparkly, nice Christmas tree. Now we're ready. I think so. Oh, oh, duh! The tree topper. Oh my God! Place it on top of the tree. Oh, a Christmas star. Place it on top of the tree. Then let Santa know that the tree is ready. I don't know that I can reach that high. Ready, jump, North Shadow. Nice. I don't know how we got up there. But we got up there. <laughs> That's all that matters. Oh, where are you going? What happened there? <laughs> Oops. Santa, we did it. Ho, ho, ho. This Christmas tree is truly splendid. If you haven't already done so, you can probably help the councilman in Silverglade Village as well. Every year he falls behind with his Christmas preparations. He could really use the help. He, all the help he could get from a Christmas expert like yourself. Oh, that's it for today. Oh no, I want to trade in Christmas wishes. I only did two. Maybe if we relog? Okay, so what I did... The I don't know if there's just there's a glitch or you can only do so many at a time. I logged out and logged back in and now I can do presents again. Oh, what do we get? I gotta keep this open. <laughs> oh, some jeans, blue harvest trousers. Um, ooh, a beautiful red jacket. Nice. It looks like the green one, but red. Some glasses. Ooh, are they red glasses? I want to put on some red glasses. Ooh, they they are, I think. Nice. Okay. What do we get? This one? Ooh, yellow. Bright yellow trousers. <laughs> now we can exchange the silver ones. These are fragments. We need three of those to make a Christmas wish. Oh, we gotta let Santa recharge a little bit. Okay, okay. Oh, look, the Morgan that Haley Shortbridge is on. The white Morgan uh, looks beautiful <laughs> in the red Christmas gear. Um, let's exchange. What do we have here? Some mittens? Oh, I can't really see. Oh, they're heart mittens. Oh, I think I have those. I thought they were Valentine's mittens. Oops. <laughs> Haley Shortbridge is saying hello. So I'm having a chat with these nice ladies while I exchange my Christmas wishes. 
Ooh. Oh, oh, is it another one of those? Yep, but that's okay. It's still beautiful. If you get duplicates, you can always sell the items that you don't want. What do we get? Oh, a yellow hat. I think I have one of those too. Oh, and it's done again. <laughs> we'll trade it next time. I got a ton of nice stuff today. I love Christmas. You end up getting so much gear and clothes. It's so cool. So Lynn and Haley, hello. It was nice to talk to you. I saw Lynn yesterday on Nova, but I was, I think before I was recording. Okay, so I figured while I'm hanging out chatting with people in game, I would read some real life letters that I got in my PO box. The first letter, let's check it out, is from Sophia. Hey Stacy, I love your videos so much. You're the best. Maybe we could meet sometime in Star Stable. I love that the ink on her letter is bright blue. <laughs> My name is Sophia Sunhill in the game. My real name is Sophia, so same thing. We could meet in Fort Pinta in the stable November 15th. Oh gosh, that was a while ago. <laughs> At 4 p.m. I am nine years old. I will send you some pictures of me and my horse Samson. Not in game, in real life. My game horse is Moon Diamond, same as your first horse in Star Stable. By Nova or Cadence. P.S. I am going to see wild horses. Yay me! I will show you when I send pictures. Oh, I would love to see pictures. I love seeing pictures of everybody's real life horses. I don't have any horses in real life, so I get to live through you guys in your pictures. She also drew some lovely pictures of horses on her letter. Thank you, Sophia. I don't know when I got this letter. I don't think it was before the 15th, though. So I apologize for that. But that's awesome. I love that you named your horse Moon Diamond. That name will always be very close to my heart because it was my first horse. And I like that name. That and Wolf Pepper, I think, are the best. <laughs> oh, goodbye. Haley Shortbridge. Yay, so letter number one. Thank you, Sophia. I really appreciate it. That's very sweet of you. And I do hope you send me pictures of the wild horses you got to see. All right, next, I actually got two letters from the same person, two separate letters. Let me read the first one here. Oh, it's a picture of Easton, Pennsylvania Center Square. Excellent, I've been to Pennsylvania a few times. Very pretty there. Hi Stacy, please email or send me more mail via my email, which I won't read out loud, um, or her address. We are also friends on Facebook. My username is Rosie Peters, so you can also message me there too from Cassidy, also known as Rachel Dogstorm. Awesome. Oh, um, I don't want to show her information, so I can't really. It's on a picture of her town square, which is really pretty. There's a fountain and some buildings. That's awesome. I wish my town had a town square like that. I would hang out by the fountain. <laughs> so let me read the second letter. Hello, Stacy. I'm Cassidy Peters, a 10 year old girl from Easton. Pennsylvania. I drew your picture. Oh, a wolf howling music notes. I also play SSO. My username is Rachel Dogstorm. So I just look for my name in the server. Nightstar and friend me if you can. I love you. I hope you like the picture from Cassidy. I love the picture. Look at that cute little wolf. <laughs> He's howling music notes. <laughs> Thank you, Cassidy. Or Rachel Dogstorm. <laughs> I really appreciate it. That's so sweet. Oh, there's a picture. Oh, here it is in big form. <laughs> nice. <laughs> he's a very musical dog. Wolf. Sorry, he's a wolf. <laughs> I love it. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. I have one more letter here from Texas. Ooh, Texas. That's where Graveyard Girl is from. I'd like to meet her someday. She seems really cool. So let's see, there's a little picture. I'll show you guys after I read. Dear Stacy, my name is Emily. I am a big fan of your videos and starstable.com. I had some questions for you, but I want to ask you in game. If you see me, please buddy me. My name in the game is Corinne Silversmith and I have eight horses. I have two Shires, a Morgan, an Appaloosa, two Andalusians, one Frisian sport horse, and my original horse. 
All right, well, bye. Please get on soon and um, right back soon. <laughs> Your fan, Emily. P.S. There's something else in the envelope, and I am eight years old. Thank you, Emily. This is cool. Check this out. <laughs> it's Star Stable and a picture of a rider on a horse. I don't know if it's supposed to be me or her. Either way. Excellent job, Emily. Especially with the logo. That looks great. That is not an easy logo to replicate. So I love it. Thank you. That's so cool. <laughs> That's a lot of horses. I'm jealous of your two Shires. <laughs> I still only have one. But I'm trying to stick to the one of every kind before I get a second one of <laughs> each kind. It's really hard. It's really, really hard. <laughs> I'm also waiting to buy an Icelandic horse. I've been wanting to get you know, the second Shire or other kinds, but I know the Icelandics are coming and I really want one of those. So oh, I'm, I'm feeling the itch to get a new horse and I do it all the time. Oh, just trying to save a little bit, save. <laughs> I had my 3000 star coins with my lifetime membership and that lasted me almost a year, a whole year. I can't believe it. And now I'm just so ready to buy every, every horse. <laughs> all right, you guys, thanks so much for joining me as I embark on the Christmas adventure <laughs> this year. It has been an amazing year and I just wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you because I'm hitting my one year mark on Star Stable and it's been one of the most exciting years that I can remember. And it's mostly thanks to you guys and you guys being so awesome and helping me along the way and being there for me and supportive and being a great community in general. <laughs> So thank you guys so, so much. I'm going to be reading some mail here next. As you can see, I'm probably going to film some more today as well. Hopefully in the next episode. And I have another special treat for you guys coming right up. So <laughs> I will see you all next time. Don't tune out until you watch the next part. <laughs> and I will talk to you again later. Bye. Hey guys, something special here at the end of the episode. I wanted to get back to featuring Star Stable YouTubers on my videos because I think it's really important to uh, um, showcase some of the awesome videos that I've seen. You guys are really, really great. Um, I wanted to play a little bit of it here. Turn it down a little bit so I can still talk from Broken Star Studio. Check it out! It is a multi-editor project, but it's incredible. I just wanted to give you a taste. I don't want to show you the whole thing. You guys have to go check it out yourselves. It's really short, but their videos are really awesome. And I highly recommend it. Um, Dusky Oak, Oak Dawn? Is it? Yes. Um, Duska Oak Dawn is a um, friend of mine on Facebook who I've spoken to a few times. And she's worked on this project with a few others. So I highly recommend it. Go check it out. It's really good. See you guys next time.